Hello guys and welcome to the Twist Network. Today this is going to be a Twist Arts production and we're going to be focusing on a tutorial uh, of displacement of objects and patterns. So in this tutorial we're going to be displacing a pattern, which is the brave flag, onto a M4 rifle. So first things first you need to pick your two images, so a pattern and an object. To overlay onto, and I'm just going to remove the background. It's better if you have a white background against a dark object because this way you can easily remove the background. So I just quickly remove the background using the magic eraser tool. Now, simply we're going to desaturate this layer. So make sure it's rasterized first of all, and then we go to images, uh, image adjustments, and desaturate. This is just going to make it black and white tones. Now we're going to press Ctrl L, bring up the levels tab, and drag in the blacks to make the blacks deeper, and drag in the whites to make the whites well brighter. This helps it stand out on a displacement map. Now that's the beginnings of our displacement map. So now we're just going to file, save as to your desktop, and save it as a PSD file. I'm going to replace mine. Now we have this. We need to just quickly undo our levels adjustment. So we've just got the desaturated image. I'll press Ctrl Z. Now we're going to take our overlay or object overlay and we're going to drag it in and blow the image up. Make sure it covers the whole of your object. So, like that, now we're going to go to filter, distort, displace. The horizontal scale and vertical scale will be set at 10. I've changed 25 to fit my uh, resolution. But you can play around these settings and such. And the displacement map and undefined areas should be set fine. Just press OK and find your displacement map. So it's this one here. And as you can see, it's actually followed the outline of the weapon into the flag. Like so. So now. Taking our flag layer selected, we're just going to press hold down control and click on the thumbnail of the underneath object, and that should uh, create a selection of this layer. Now, on the top layer, we're just going to add a mask and this will overlay it. Now, we're just going to set the thing to overlay. So, as you can see, it's just overlaid the British flag onto the M4. Now, you can obviously play around with different effects with this. So, light color overlay. Vivid light looks alright, a lot brighter. Uh, linear light again, vivid light's got more depth. Of course, you can play around with, with this to your liking. So, I think my favourite is vivid light. So, that's basically it, guys. That's the tutorial. Uh, as far as I know, you can just merge these layers now, and you've got your your flag slash object. That so that was my tutorial. I'm Dan uh, from Twist Network. Subscribe for more tutorials. Like obviously, so it helps our channel grow. Uh, follow us on Twitter, uh, and that's it, really, guys. Peace out.